I believe in more than one place in the Bible, it tells us to be perfect. Okay. We were born in the flesh. And I believe the flesh has a sinful nature. Okay. So how can you be perfect with a sinful nature? You may believe. Since you can't say everything rightly, since you can't do everything right, you are no good for living for Jesus Christ. This is not true. The Bible says to be perfect, but you have to have the right understanding of that. Since we were born in the flesh, I don't think we can be 100% perfect. If you read in the New Testament, the Apostle Paul claimed to not be perfect. So who is greater? What human on earth is greater than the Apostle Paul? Maybe not many of us. So if he claimed to not be perfect, what about us? What I believe being perfect is, or how should I say this? I believe what God looks for is a heart that is conformed. A heart that wants to do right, if you understand what I am saying. You may not do what is right, but your intention is to do what is right. I hope this makes sense. So I can have the mind, I can have the heart to want to do what is right. But I may say the wrong word. I may do the wrong thing. I may have the wrong thoughts. But let's say I am constantly trying to become better. Like striving for perfection, even though I may err. So, the, the goal is perfection, yes. Even though I may not reach perfection while I am living on this earth, I believe God is looking for me trying to reach the end goal. I hope this makes sense. So, <clears throat> listen to this as well. Let's say you have been purposely wanting to do wrong for many years or some years. How can you attempt for a short period of time trying to live for Jesus Christ in let's say a month or a year or whatever like that, how can you expect to do everything right, to say everything right, 
and have the proper thoughts in a short period of time. How can you expect that? How? I believe you will drive yourself nuts in having these extremely high expectations that probably none can do. Yes, I believe day by day, we have to become more like Jesus Christ. So we have to die to ourselves each day. I believe we have to do that, meaning become less like ourselves and become more like Jesus Christ every day. Yet, I believe you are going to error. I believe you may make so many mistakes, but that does not mean you are not ready to live for Jesus Christ. Take your time. Not so much take your time, but what is a good word for it? Don't be so hard on yourself. If you fail, continue trying. Don't give up. Don't say you rather go to hell other than continue making errors and trying to live for Jesus Christ. That makes no sense. Never give up. Let me stop here. God bless you.